Hi, today let's talk about what is the best time to go to Ladakh. And it's not it's not one particular time period that works for uh, everyone. It depends on what you're really trying to focus on and what kind of experience you really want to get. So Ladakh will start to open uh, like the passes. If you're planning to ride right up to Leh, then the passes sort of start to open anywhere between uh, April uh, kind of thing. If you want to be one of the first people to ride as soon as the road is open, then the advantage is that probably traffic is uh, lesser. But then always remember that if you're trying to get that, have a bit of a flexible uh, itinerary because the roads are still opening. It's very hard to predict when exactly this will happen. So have enough flexibility in your uh, schedule that allows you to go and wait there. Don't, if you're on a really tight itinerary, then don't try and go as early in the season as possible <clears throat> because then your time pressure will get you into trouble. Uh, somebody might tell you that the road is open and you might uh, want to risk it. There'll still be a lot of snow and the going will be really uh, hard. Another recommendation that I would give is if you really want to be the first few people as soon as the road opens, then go with a few uh, people. Avoid uh, doing it alone. It's much easier for the four-wheelers to go into some of those conditions than to be on a motorcycle. Then the next uh, thing, if you're planning to go planning to go with kids and family and this, that, then your time is automatically fixed according to your kids' uh, vacations. So that's probably going to be May, June, July, depending on which part you're in. Now, May, June, July uh, and maybe early August. Remember, these are also some of the busiest times in Leh. So expect a lot of traffic and expect a few uh, disruptions here and there. Also remember that it's going to be, uh, if you're going after June, then also take into account that there's going to be monsoons and this is the early uh, monsoons as such. So if you're planning to ride down all the way from, you know, whether you're in, in the north or uh, further down south like Bombay, Pune or even further down south, then remember that if it's raining, you might not be able to cover as much distance as you had uh, planned because the rain will really uh, slow you down. So that's one thing to take into account. Also, a lot of times there are disruptions due to monsoons, either in the foothills or uh, in the plains. So that also means that you need a little bit of uh, flexibility in your uh, schedule or uh, you need to be flexible enough to make changes according to the weather uh, as required. Either in the early phase or uh, in the later phase, be very confident in your abilities and have a really realistic picture of your uh, abilities. Don't turn this into an ego mission that you have to push on irrespective of the conditions. Just remember that you're on a leisure ride, there's nothing to prove and there's nothing great to achieve. You're not really doing this to save uh, somebody's life and the stakes are not very high on a motorcycle trip. During the monsoon period, if you're hitting uh, Ladakh, then also remember that, you know, sometimes nowadays it does rain even uh, in Ladakh. So really make sure that you're carrying uh, good uh, rain protection. If you get wet and all your gear is wet and it is uh, uncomfortable to carry on then be a little flexible and you can take a day or a couple of days off your schedule to just recuperate in the monsoons even if it is not raining uh, in Ladakh what you'll find is uh, that the sky is often uh, cloudy so if you enjoy that kind of uh, clouds and if you enjoy that white and blue weather pattern then monsoons is really the time to Go. you get some spectacular skies in that sense maybe not so much of the night sky but during the daytime if it's good weather it can be really beautiful as well i i like it another good time to go to ladakh is post monsoon and post uh, all the school holidays and uh, things here what happens is you're going to get uh, decent weather now some of the roads might be impacted by the monsoon or some of the road construction work uh, might be complete so all the road conditions one can't really say with great uh, certainty as to what's the best uh, time but September is generally reasonably decent road conditions I mean you could start mid-August to August end onward till really September end is also a good time to go the benefit here is that uh, it's at the fag end uh, of the season you might find some days getting really cold especially towards the second half of uh, September but otherwise skies are generally clear traffic is uh, less a lot of the road construction work is if you're lucky already done or if you're unlucky you'll be in the middle of it that's all up to September end September and October the roads might still be open but that's when it gets a little risky in case there's some unusual weather activity 
now it's not a question of waiting for a few days for the roads to open like the beginning of the season in fact it's the reverse a small temporary blockage might then lead to permanent road closure suddenly if that's the only time you get uh, then that's the risk you're uh, carrying here again don't let your ego interfere with your uh, planning if you find that the weather conditions are dicey stay put wherever you are stay safe and then if you're in lay or somewhere around you can always uh, fly out but you'll have to leave your motorcycle or uh, car behind so be prepared for that if you're really trying to push it to the end of the season so this is how you approach uh, the itinerary or this is how you really decide uh, what time you want to go in lay if you want a lot of white landscape uh, then try and hit uh, in the early of earlier in the season or as early as possible but yeah you've got nice white uh, pictures uh, for your instagram and to show to your friends and all the middle of the season uh, is safer and easier in terms of um, the riding a lot of infrastructure is uh, set up everything is uh, open but then uh, before you reach uh, ladakh there might be a lot of disruption primarily because of the monsoons towards the closing uh, part of the season uh, that's again a good time to go uh, some of the infrastructure might be winding uh, down but more or less uh, it's all right the skies are uh, clear the weather might be a little colder than what you do in the middle of the season if you really leave it to the fag uh, end then there is again lesser and lesser people but the risk of uh, getting stuck gets higher and higher at the at the beginning of the season uh, if a certain road closes then you can wait for it to open up but in the end of the season uh, if something like that happens then that's that's it that is the uh, end so prepare uh, prepare yourself for that uh, risk all right hope this uh, helps you plan your rides bye